Alright, what's up everyone? Today we are gonna make a Bleach mobile 3D video because someone, one of my favorite characters of Bleach Brave Souls, if not my favorite character being the 6th anniversary Aizen. We've waited for so long for anniversary Aizen. And when the 6th anniversary came, we got this amazing design, fantastic 6th anniversary Aizen. And now he is actually in this game. Two, he, he, here he is, and now we are gonna make a series called Road to Six Universe Aizen. Because here it's not like in Bleach Bears or in, in any other gacha where you actually summon for the character. Here, for the special characters, you have to exchange these crystals and this as well, and you actually get this from summoning. But or just summoning for anyone you want. I mean, you can get this from someone just in general. But when, if I actually choose a character to get, because there are two characters. But some characters require this blue stuff, while some uh, other require this. But for Ryzen, it, it requires this blue crystal, the Gen Kaleido, Kaleido, whatever. And those crystals that, that you can get for the summoning. But here it's 50 of these crystals. For the other ones, it's like 20 for this Kukako, but this Aizen is 60. This is gonna be a tough, tough thing to do. And when I choose a, a character to exchange those crystals for, to get a character, for example, right now, I actually before this Aizen, I actually chose this Aizen, the most Aizen, I mean, I mean the Butterfly Aizen. And I have about 15 of his shards. So, what I'm looking for when choosing a character, just choose a character I want and then when summoning for those crystals, I look, for example, I go to the characters, to the character list, the gallery, go to the character that I actually chose, which is somewhere down here, this Aizen, and then look his bond. You can do that by going to detail and bond, and see what characters that you can actually summon for. For example, here on the summon for the recruit, you have the regular summon and then a limited time summon. And those you can actually get without exchanging and just by summoning. But you have to have 160 tickets to get them. You cannot get them otherwise. Because here you only get them from those shards that it gives you while summoning. You cannot actually put the character itself from the summoning. Just do 160 tickets to get them at shards to. Uh, to get the character that actually you're summoning for. So with that said, what I'm looking for is to have the characters bond of the character I'll choose and summoning for those characters. Now that, that I want Aizen, for example, I went for the butterfly Aizen and his bonds are for example of the characters I, I summon because some of those characters like this why they Aizen or this Mugetsu or this Parasol and Uetora, those characters is like the exchange again, you exchange for them. But this He Aizen, this Uekomundo Aizen, is actually for someone you can actually summon. So when this Aizen comes, I could summon for him, but not only him, for example, Danga Ichigo as well. Here, when it gives you like, for Aizen, when you put Aizen in the bones, it gives you attack, but when you put Danga Ichigo, it gives you HP. So I summoned for Danga Ichigo, but I didn't have 166 tickets, so I couldn't get him, so I got only those shards. But when he comes back, I'm gonna summon and get him. And then we are going to work on him and try him and get him as hard as possible to upgrade it. Upgrade it. And then when I get like Butterfly Aizen, I can put that Danga Ichigo on bones and get even bigger power, high power on my Butterfly Aizen. And as well as this Ukiora here as well and also some other characters that I, that I actually see here on the bonds and if they are summonable I'm gonna summon for those characters for the characters, for the character that I choose to get from the exchange look to his bonds and see what characters he has as bonds that actually summonable, sum, summonable. so for example this Aizen, this Danga Ichigo, this Ukiora um, this Bargain I believe summonable, summonable this swimsuit Unahana as well, and just just some of those characters. And when I get them, 
I'm, when I sell them for them, I'm gonna get those crystals, and I'm gonna get those characters, upgrade them, put them on bonds, and then I'm gonna have a lot of power for the character I choose to get from the exchange. With that being said, what we are going to do in this video is we are going to play to get those materials to up your character. For example, when I go to the character list over here on the quality, we're gonna play for, to get those. But right now, let's see what I don't have so I can play because now it's double rewards. So this is the best time to play. Uh, we go to gears and see it looks like I have a little bit for you know what we're gonna play for those shields the white shields the green shields because I already auto that uh, uh, I already skipped with using the, those auto tickets to skip for all the colors of the swords like white green and so on and so forth now I, I guess we're gonna play for the shoots which is right over here in the story on the second thing here you can play for the shoots all right let's play one for the whites then green then blue then in purple and that's gonna be it for this video so yeah just for starting off this series this is gonna be the video the first video of this series so let's just begin with our first game against this centipede looking thing and I'm gonna show some gameplay for this game which is actually pretty pretty cool my character now is swimsuit Ichigo and he's actually a bond for Danga Ichigo so when I get, Dan when I get Danga Ichigo I'll be able to put that that switch to Ichigo as his bond so I get high high rank for him alright let's just go here alright now let's use our Kenpachi and blow them away alright nice nope boom disappear alright now let's transform and look that cool animation with the watermelon blast in the face and then some more watermelon boom now the boss is coming alright where are you boss the centipede thing there you are one shot boom deleted all right, we didn't get those those shoots unfortunately. Let's just do it again because we have two tries per day. And yeah, we begin again with the second game. All right, those guys can go to hell instantly, one shot immediately. Those two, boom. Now let's go and kill those guys as well. Nice. Oh, use. Oh, okay, they're dead. Alright, now you two can die. You two can die as well. Not even time for you to attack me. Yes, it's my Gin Izumaru. Uh, I mean Gin Ichimaru. I don't know what, why is it Izumaru. <laughs> uh, Alright, now that's it, the pet creature. Boom. One shot. Disappear. Do my sight. Alright, one more game for the white stuff. Okay, here we go. Now this is a bit too easy, so maybe it will bore you, but if you enjoy the gameplay and want to see some gameplay, here we go. Boom. Easy, easy, easy. Alright. Let's destroy those guys, as well as this. I think my second part about this series will be when actually summoning for Danga Ichigo. Or maybe when I have official 60 tickets. And Okiora comes, or maybe Aizen comes, we got to summon for the type too. But since I already have shots for Danga Ichigo, when he comes back, I wouldn't even need to go with the 160 tickets because I already have a bit of shots for him. But if he doesn't come and I already have 160 tickets, I'm gonna go for the Aizen or Kyora or whoever comes. Alright. Center Pit Creature, you wanna die? Let's, let's just see what will happen. We will reach 160 tickets before we get, uh, before Daga Ichigo comes and maybe when Aizen comes since we will see, we will see what happens in the future. Alright, this is done. Now let's go for green stuff. I actually skipped those. I already did that. So let's see if we can do this against this, this looking Marfica Halo. Alright, let's go. And there we go, see you Nemo. Alright, let's destroy those now. BAM! Nope, you're not atta attacking me, bro. Forget it, you can just disappear. Alright. You two. Die! You're still alive. Okay, now, Gin Ichimaru. 
We destroyed him. Alright. No. Die. Okay, nice. You two can die. You two can die too. Now, we're gonna transform. And we're gonna one-shot you. Oh, almost. Almost. He was left with a significant amount of HP. Alright, we got some of those shields now. Pretty good, pretty good. And now we're gonna wait for the character that, that we get from summoning. Will it be Danga Ichigo? Or maybe Kiora? Or maybe Aizen? Or maybe Simsu Tunahana? We will just have to wait and see. So, but for now, we're gonna collect those materials. And when that character comes, we're gonna upgrade them to the highest possible. But since this Ichigo is bonus for Danga Ichigo, I may wanna go for Danga Ichigo. I have to see what bonus Aizen has or what bonus Kiora have. And we will see, but for now I think the best thing to do is just go for Dangan Ichigo. Since that, that Ichigo, my strongest character is Wizard Ichigo, already has high power. So yeah. <coughs> and then maybe we go for Aizen the second time. Since one summoning one type of character won't be enough to get the most uh, the butterfly Aizen, you have to summon multiple times. So maybe I have to summon 40 characters of his bonds. And then we can actually begin saving for... Um, we can actually begin focusing on... 16 West Aizen because that butterfly Aizen is actually a bond for, uh, for 16 West Aizen. So maybe if I get get him first and then I'll focus on 16 West Aizen and then I'll put uh, fly Aizen, butterfly Aizen on his bones. Alright. Do I have some skip tickets left? Let's just see because I want to just skip the boring stuff. I, I have exactly one. Alright, go away. Alright, now you do one for blue and one for purple. Just one. So I don't waste any more of your time. But what should I do? Should I? Nah, this is already fight. I already sk skipped those. We already fought this stupid creature. Let's fight the Menos Grande. Alright, let's just go. Okay. Those little guys can go to hell. Those can go to hell too. Okay. Oh, you're still coming. Show me the boss. Alright. Boom! Kenpachi come and destroy them. Okay, here's the boss. Let's transform for the boss. Being Menos Grande. And he's dead. Easy. Menos Grande is weak. Very weak. Alright then, let's begin for the purple. Since I, I don't have enough, I, I don't think I've reached the golden. Look how many purple there are. Just look how many purple there are compared to blue and... Ah, actually no. Okay, okay, my bad, okay. Well, actually the purples, uh, the oranges, I cannot see. S since the after purple is orange, then red, and then after red is golden, which is the highest rate. Alright. Let's just fight. Kenpachi, let's fight Kenpachi, I guess. Alright, here we go. Let's fight our boy, Kenpachi Zaraki. Nice. Die. Okay, this is going to be an easy battle. Since he has a lot of health. But we can still get, kill him. No props. Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. Have some watermelon. Shot. Okay, he chose us as well. This is gonna be a tough match since he's strong and won't be getting one shot yet. Alright. But I can still beat him though. Maybe maybe not, maybe he can attack me. Alright, let's transform. Throw him some watermelon and he's dead. And okay guys, that was it for this first part of me trying to get six in the rest Ryzen. But for now we're gonna focus on the most on the Flyzen because he's we already begin on him. And he is a bond on system of the size, and so we can actually get him, use him as bond, and yeah. But since I have to summon to get this, those crystals to get Flyzen, Butterfly Aizen, I'm gonna just summon for the characters that are his bonds, being Danga, Aizen, the Oikomondo Aizen, I mean. Ukiora, Suisu Tunahana, Bargan, I believe was summonable, I think Halebe was his bond as well. So we have plenty of options, but I think I'm gonna begin with Danga. Ichigo. I mean, if he comes before I get 160 tickets. And okay, guys, that was it for this Bleach Mobile 3D video. If you want to see the progression 
of my account and gain 600 Saiyan if you wanna see when I finally get the 600 Saiyan and when I progress and get even higher power right now my highest power is only this Ichigo with 150,000 and he's golden I have three purple and couple blues right over here if you wanna see me progress you can just subscribe and hey guys thank you so much for watching see you on the next one peace